I'm going to say a little bit more about uh, the education scene and the MOOC. I, I talked to JD about the MOOC on the Wild Show. I don't think he's going to be here tomorrow, but I might, might talk to Chris about it, about the MOOC a little bit. We've 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 decided it's not a, a an animal wandering around the marshes near the River X. It's um it's a an international platform for massive open courses. Oh, well, they're not quite so massive now as they were a while ago. Uh, they they start more often, and they're much more focused. And some of them, you have to pay money for a certificate and ways into degrees and things like that. Um, but I've retweeted an article by, or a link to an article by Neil Mosley, or Neil Mosley Five. All, lower, all lowercase, N-E-I-L-M-O-S-L-E-Y, five. Because uh, th this, is, this is something he's, he's written about before and he's, he's updated it, I think. Um, I, haven't, I haven't studied the, the blog post completely, but I, I think this is worth mentioning because um, what I think he's on about is the way that in the United States the universities or the platforms are linking the 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 routes from the the MOOC courses the open and free courses into the degree offers so the universities are benefiting from that in for um, more people doing their courses including the online courses um, so edX and Coursera uh, seem to be doing that okay whereas I think what Neil M Mosley is asking about is whether the UK um, universities are working with future learning quite the same sort of way I mean s some of the UK universities anyway are working with edX and Coursera uh, but it's still a, a fair question how integrated that sort of thing is um, I, I think it's also worth looking at Class Central, who have a lot of information about MOOCs, but they also do articles. And I'm I'm not sure how to... Is it to you? To, I don't know how to spell it. It doesn't really matter on the radio. It's, to, to, it's either the character to or the letters T-W-O-U. Um, they've, they've bought edX, and they are a platform for degrees and courses and stuff. Um, but Class Central keep trying to explain, uh, as they observe things, um, how edX is working with 2U as, as a way of uh, essentially marketing for the degree courses, um, as well as offering MOOCs, which still still happens. Um, the, other, the other thing I'd just say, that the, the, um, the vocational courses are becoming a, a much larger part of the MOOC scene. Um, that's on the content, so there's content from IBM and Google and accountancy firms and so forth, um, and the kind of qualification you can get might get a, a vocational route. Um, but I, d I don't think I don't think that's a terrible thing because all the humanities and social science can coexist with that, and the the technology, the ed tech, is developed. Of the AI and all those things, um, I would say quite quite often by those those uh, large companies, not just by universities. You know, especially if the universities aren't aren't really convinced about the value of this sort of thing anyway.